Hey, what's going on YouTube, and welcome to week four of the TIC tri -Tac Corporation Draft League, season, t season two, week four. I'm actually recording this technically during week two, because I switched up with um, Mr. Stell's battles, because uh, he had something he needed to do, so he's taking, when my week four match, he'll battle uh, uh, Liam instead of me, so we, we just swapped. Um, but this will still go up when it's supposed to, so... That's just some background of what's going on. So this is a, I recorded this a little early, uh, and I don't have this team because on the bottom I, I have all the Pokemon saved, but this is last minute, so they're not on the layout. I just prepared for every Pokemon he has, so let's just see what he has. I sort of prepared for everything. Okay, we see Delmise. We see Delmise. We see Aegislash. Uh, Aegislash. We see Tyranitar. I'm worried about the time limit here. We see Tyranitar. Let me make that Age of Slash a little bigger. We see Milotic. Um, Milotic. And we see Hatterene. We see Hatterene. Um, what's that? Oh, thank you. Um... I need to pick my team. And then Pinkurchin's his last Pokemon. So, um, we're gonna lead Chandelure. Shoot. Durant. Shoot! Did it select my team? Hold on. Okay, good, it did. It selected the rest of my team. And then we see Pinkurchin. Oh, well, it randomly selected, and that ended up benefiting us in the end. Um, so that's good. So there we go. So that ended up benefiting us. There's no reason why I should have let that. Um, I think I just Earthquake. Nothing takes an Earthquake super well. So we're going to Earthquake. I can see this being weakness policy. Oh, he set up Stealth Rocks. That's a little bit of a problem for our team, but it should be okay. Uh, we don't KO. Is it weakness policy? We do not see the weakness policy. Um, I'm gonna go for another Earthquake in case he switches, which I could totally see him doing. Um, but there's no reason not to Earthquake. He doesn't have anything that can take an Earthquake well. He does switch. Into Delmise. That's not super surprising. Um, and I don't want to switch anything. Although, Mudsdale is very good in this matchup in this match, so I see him going for, no matter what he does, I think Durant's a good switch in, actually, so we're going to go into Durant, he might double switch, but Durant's definitely a good switch in here, Durant's, Durant's a great switch in here. And he's anchor shotting, so we're trapped in Durant. I'm in Dynamax. There's no reason for me not to. Does anything take a max bug? Yeah, not not really. Uh, actually, Aegis Slash does. Um, I could see him switching into Aegis Slash. Uh, I'm gonna go for max bug anyway. Okay, so I think we KO the um the Delmice here. Which is good. Delmise is basically the, his only answer to um, to Mudsdale. So getting rid of it early game is good. I don't have any problem wasting my Dynamax here. That should KO. I don't see any world where it doesn't. Yep. Awesome. Early KO there. 
Durant getting that max slaughter buy off. Togemaru looks really good in this match too. Togemaru handles everything well except for um except for Aegis Slash. Um I think we beat the uh Milotic here too. We might just one bang this Milotic with Max Lightning. I don't see anything that could take a Max Lightning, so. Um no it survives, but it'll die to hit. it'll die to Sandstorm. Um it's gonna go for Scold, I'm guessing. Which is fine. Yeah. It goes for Scald. And we survive. And we don't get burned. And it goes down Sandstorm. Awesome. That's very good. Now we're in a very good position for Durant to kill another Pokemon. We're in a great position now. He has no answers for, um, he has no answers for, um, Epona at all now. He's King Shielding, obviously. That's fine. He burns my Dynamax. Um, I decide what I want to lock myself into, or I, or I need to switch. Although, I don't see a reason not to Iron Head. It's a weakness policy. Um, although I'm pretty sure opponent can still take a hit. Yeah, I'm gonna um, I'm gonna lock myself into Thunderfang. He's faster. That's Shadow Snake. Yeah. Okay. Denver goes down. That's fine. Nothing really t Nothing wants to switch into an Earthquake from, um... Actually, I should have gone... I should have gone, um... That's fine. Nothing wants to... Nothing wants to take an Earthquake. So likely he just either King Shields or Sacks it. Um... He'll be faster, I think, but... That's fine. Yeah, he King Shields. In case he's not faster. Nothing wants to take an Earthquake right now. Nothing on his team wants to take an Earthquake. Um, I think I one-shot everything except for... Um, except for Hatterene with an Earthquake. I don't see a reason for him to go for Hatterene. I think I just win this match with Mudsdale. He sword stances. That was a really dumb move. There's no way this is surviving an earthquake unless he's defense invested. I think that was his shot at winning, though. Yeah. So Aegis Slash goes down to an earthquake. He has no counter. Yeah, he has no... Nothing for Mudsdale at this point, I don't think. And I do have Body Press, so if he brings back in Tyranitar, I might just Body Press instead of Earthquake. Um. Actually, I don't see a reason not to Earthquake. Yeah, I don't see a reason not to Earthquake. He's just going for some chip. Which is smart. That's solid chip, too. Although I should be fine. Okay. So that crit <laughs> totally mattered. Okay. So we've got Hatterene and Puke and Mook, er, and uh, Pinkurchin. Um, so if Mudsdale goes down, I go into Chandelure. If, Mud if Mudsdale goes down, I go into Chandelure. Um, I don't see any world where Mudsdale doesn't just kill these two, though. I'm faster than Hatterene. This is Trick Room. Yeah, it does over half. Half. I should be able to take a hit fine. It goes for Trick Room. Which may have been the wrong play on his part. Actually, it's probably the right play. Um, because I need something that can survive a hit from McCurchin. 
Although Token of Mario should be able to do that. Um, Dazzling Gleam, I should take that fine. Yeah, awesome. So there goes there goes Hatterene, and then Pinkurchin has to kill my entire team. And I don't see that happening. I don't see Pinkurchin killing the rest of my team. I just don't see it happening. And this isn't a max speed mods deal, so I might just outspeed Pinkurchin. I doubt it. I might just take any hit it has. The only chance it has is Liquidation. And I don't see that doing enough. Eh, actually no, that could totally kill me at this range. I'm at plus two though. Earthquake definitely kills though. Yeah, Liquidation. Um. Yeah, Mudsdale's down. That's fine. I think... I think we go Toga to Mario. Um, I don't know anything he could do against Toga to Mario. So we're gonna go Toga to Mario. Um, and we are going to Zen Headbutt. Oh yeah, he still has his Dynamax. That is one thing he has on me. But if Token Amaru goes down, that's fine. I think we switch to, Z to Zing Zap. Probably. He's gonna try to Max Lightning me, I think. Max Geyser. Yeah, I'm going to take that fine, probably. Yeah, I took it. Not fine. Oh, he needed that sand gone. Oh, it's Life Orb. That's why I didn't take it fine. That did not do as much damage as I thought it would do. This is a problem. We waste two turns of his Dynamax for Token Mario. And I think Trick Room returns to normal now. So he kills Token Mario, making this a lot closer of a battle than I want it to be. Um, do the Twisted Dimension, yeah, Twisted Dimensions return to normal. Um, we'll go into Coco. <clears throat> um, and Coco can um can D Gleam here. This is a choice backs too, so should do a decent. Yeah, that did a decent chunk. So if I survive a hit, then uh, then I'm good. But I won't. I won't. Not not with, not with electric train up. But uh, anything else on my team can kill Pinkurchin. Um, because it's on Dynamax now. Um, we're gonna go. I'm trying to decide. Yeah, we'll go. We'll go Thea Queen. The attack stat on on Unfezen is just so high. I don't see any circumstance where it survives a facade. So we're gonna go for for facade. And we get the KO. So good game to Liam and uh, the Pittsburgh Steelixes. All my matches have been <laughs> have been two O's. Uh, but thank you all for watching. Uh, this obviously will go up during week four, but this is actually before my week three match, so I actually don't know if all my matches will be 2-0. Two, two oh. um, but yeah, thank you all for watching. I'll see you guys next time. If you're new to the channel, subscribe. And um, like the video if you enjoyed it. So I'll see you guys next time.